welcome back to I Dream of Wigs and thank you for stopping in for this review today of Henry Margu's Kindle in the color 88GR. If you're brand new here, my name is Missy and I am with TL Wigs. In my description box down below, you will always find everything you need to get to TL Wigs website, the direct product link, and our private Facebook group. So, let's get started on this. I was looking through all of my reviews, and I knew that I had done a review on Kindle before, but it has been a long time, a year to be exact, and it was my 100th uh, video upload to YouTube. So, now I don't know how many I, I have, but... Uh, I wanted to review this again because I felt like the first time I didn't quite give it the justice that it needs. So first we're going to go over this color, 88GR. This is one of my favorite Henry Margu colors and I tend to, um, what, I tend to get stuck on this color alone and I just buy all of my Harry Margu wigs in the same color. So I have another coming today, actually, Harry Margu, and I believe it's Riley, and I switched my color up a little bit to 26GR. So this 88GR is a wheat blonde with light strawberry blonde highlights on a medium brown root. It is gorgeous and the ends to me now the description does not say this about um, the color itself but the ends to me always look like they're tipped with a lighter blonde and I don't know if you can see that or not but it's just the way that color always comes off and I believe that that's why I love this color so much so let me give you a spin all the way around and get that out of the way before I forget you saw me at the beginning take this out of the box and exactly everything that I did to it that is all I've done to it if you're not using Envy's get dressed the dimmer spray you need to be using this not only does this stuff take that shine out but it adds some great texture to these full mono tops that have zero permatease up on the top so this is a staple in my wig wearing as far as styling and getting that shine out. Also, you saw me use the wig wax and I held that upside down and I sprayed that all over and then just kind of scrunched it in. So to get this lift up here, all I did was just keep sweeping and sweeping my hands back until I got that lifted contour um, that I like. So like I said, this is a full mono top and you have an ear to ear lace front. I also showed you all of that, you know, whenever I unboxed it and, and went through the, the cap features and things like that. This is a regular synthetic, so you cannot apply your heat to style this, but it is just gorgeous. Did you know that this is one of Henry Margu's best-selling wigs of all time. And I think it's easy to see why. This is a style that is just so flattering to all faces, I believe. I'm a little bit, you know, chunky down here and sometimes my cheeks puff up. All I have to do is bring these layers into my face and it's like I have an instant facelift. So I do believe that everyone that I have seen wear Henry Margu Kindle looks absolutely amazing. So if you are one that is rocking the Henry Margu Kindle, let me know in the comments below. I bet I've seen it and I bet you I think that you are just as beautiful in yours as everyone else. She's so versatile and Henry Margu fibers are if you've not ever had a Henry Margu, let me just say this. Okay. The fibers on Henry Margu, the regular synthetics, they are 
true workhorse fibers. And I mean, they lasted out for sometimes years. So let's go over the specs on this. So the front piece is seven inches long. So you can wear it kind of swept down across of your forehead if you want, right like that. And like I said, I have to put, you know, some of the, the wig wax on there. So that is seven inches long. The crown is seven to 11 inches long. The nape underneath is eight to 10 inches. The overall length of this is perfect, perfect for these warm summer months. It is 16 inches from the crown to the tips, and this weighs three and a half ounces. So it's just, it's a perfect style for summer, and you need to get one. So I'm going to show you this awesome lace front. I don't think you can get much better with a lace front as with Henry Margot. It, it It's right up there with um, Beltress as far, and Raquel Welch, as far as those just melting right into your forehead. So a lot of times what I like to do with my Kindle is you saw while I had that pulled up off of the face, I just put a little jaw clip in there and it is so pretty. And with that extended lace, no one is gonna know that you're wearing a wig. So let's do a spin all the way around again. And I wanna thank you guys so much for being here. If you could, please hit that subscribe button. I put out content a couple of times a week. I don't get over excessive with it and, you know, try and post every single day. Um, but a couple of times a week, I usually try and do all of my reviews in one or two days and get them knocked out for the week because I have things to do. So thanks again. And my next stop will be outside for you guys to see this color. All right, so here is this beautiful 88GR out in the full sun. And I'm going to go ahead and spin all the way around, see if you can see what it looks like in the movement outdoors. Let's see the strawberry blonde highlights. It is gorgeous. I don't know if you can see... The tips, like I was talking, that they're a little bit lighter. This color, if you um, like John Renault's Shaded Sun, uh, I believe that that color code is 27T613S8. This is almost identical to it. So, yeah, she is so pretty. All right, guys, thank you. Have a great weekend, okay?